Hi, my name is Lisa and today I want to talk to you about the law of projection or the law of the mirror which says that everybody that we have in our life is actually a mirror to ourselves. Everything that we see in others is re reflecting something of ourselves. So when you see someone that is very critical, is criticizing everything or everyone and that really bothers you, what this person is telling you is not necessarily that you are also uh, criticizing other and other things, but that you're very critical to yourself. You're very demanding. And this is what the mirrors are telling us. What we see in others is actually things that we're doing to ourselves. So maybe um, you realize that you that people are not respecting others or people are not respecting yourself. So what that's telling you is that you are not respecting yourself. And again, maybe you see someone that's very generous and then that's something as well that you're being very generous. So you need to understand that every person that's in your life is showing you something of yourself. Uh, so what's important is to realize what they're showing you to see if it's something that you want to keep or something that you want to work on, something that you want to change. Maybe someone in your life is hurting others or it's hurting yourself. Again, if you see somebody that's uh, hurting others uh, or hurting yourself, it's what you're doing to yourself. If somebody's hurting you, you are allowing this. So you are hurting yourself. If somebody's not being respectful to you or to others, uh, is showing you that you're not being respectful to yourself. And if this person doing it to you, it's because you're allowing it. You're not respecting yourself by allowing it. If somebody's hurting you, the same thing. So it's very important to see what uh, the other people are telling us of ourselves to be able to, to work with that. And sometimes they can be like an opposite mirror. And what this means is that maybe someone that's very selfish is in our lives and we just cannot you know, deal with that person. And we don't understand why this person is so selfish. And we realize that we are not selfish and we, are not, uh, we don't have this trait in our lives. But maybe what's happening, what this person is showing us is that uh, it's the opposite. It's not that we're being selfish with ourselves, but the opposite, that we are not taking care of ourselves. We put everybody else before us and we put ourselves last. And then we're not able to help others when we don't take care of ourselves. So this is what that is telling us. And we need to work on it. And often when we need to, to work on these situations, and we do, uh, suddenly those people that were difficult in our lives are not there anymore. They're not difficult or whatever bothered us before doesn't bother us anymore. Um, they're also mirrors in the sense that they're showing us people from our family systems that usually have been judged or criticized. So by being able to accept that person the way they are, we're able to connect to the family members that were not accepted the way they were. And we're able to heal that aspect because we're doing what the, someone in the past was not able to do. And we're accepting everybody the way they are. So um, this is what I wanted to share with you today. If you have any questions or comments, please uh, let me know. And my website is coachingandconstellations.com. Thank you so much for listening. Bye.